Hello everyone, my name is Lanso90 and welcome back to Let's Play Unturn. So, I left off, we're trying to figure out how to craft stuff. Wooden support. Um, Probably just have to look something up, you know? There's only so much guessing I could do here. Where did our nails go? Oh, there they are. Aha, uh -huh, arrows. Those are pretty useful. That's the ammo for our crossbow. Well, let's let's go ahead and make these because it's kind of what we kind of what we're looking for, more or less. Me, cats in here. Okay, so I guess we can't get wood for trees after all. No more ammo in this, only one bullet. Okay. Wish we had some kind of map. Be nice to know where else we could go. Also wish I could, like, build a chest put stuff in. Let's get to the top of this hill and see what we can see. What we can see with our elf eyes. Go back to the farmhouse and see like if items respawn. There's that town over there. Not too interested in going to the towns, to be honest, because it's scary. Better to go to those at night time when I can, like, hide better. I assume I hide better at night. Berries. We've already t determined that zombies respawn. I think. I saw one where there shouldn't have been one. But we haven't determined what else can respawn. Well, this stuff is still all here. There's a shotgun I dropped, and those shells are still here. Is there anything new anywhere in this house? There's this rifle. I don't remember that being here. Maybe I do. There's no zombies here, though, so... Maybe I was wrong about them respawning. Should probably try planting the seeds and stuff as well. Okay, so, so far, items haven't despawned, but, this is a big but, I don't know if they'll stay there if I exit the game and come back. Let's go check out the other farm. See that clip is still on the ground. The real question comes on whether or not it'll always be there.
Could kill those two zombies just for the hell of it. I haven't regained any health lately either. Not sure what's up with that. Let's see if zombies respond here, because this is where I thought one responds before, but. Maybe I just missed one. Everything looks the same here as well. I wonder if I could use cars as storage. Cycle through seats, one through F6. Interesting. So nothing's responds, and items have stayed where they've been. Let's get some water again. Oh dear. We try going to that one military base or something over there. Guess we could go and try to investigate that. I don't want to take a risk that I'm not going to come back from something because we finally made some progress. Don't want to waste it. Lucky we found this canteen, since it's like an infinite source of drinking. I don't think it would be that easy to eat or to drink. I thought I'd have to like purify the water and everything. I don't quite have as much food as I thought I did either. It's not too big of a problem. I see animals everywhere. <laughs> Just haven't bothered trying to kill one yet, so I figured I'd need a fire. But maybe I don't. Let's go across this lake and see what that red building is. <laughs> I think those guys should change the clouds. Because this game doesn't look so much like Minecraft that it needs like square clouds, because like the trees aren't block trees. The ground isn't block ground. I don't think the clouds need to be squares. But <clears throat> Oh, interesting. This is like a dead end. Kind of makes me wonder if this is a kind of sort of secret area. Is it bridge to nowhere? No. Oh, there's a lot of zombies here. I 
You know, I could try to shoot my way through them, but I don't know if that's a good idea. But I do kind of like the idea of being able to explore this place in peace. Freaking crossbow is pretty badass. Killing with the crossbow because the ammo for it was wasn't too hard to make. I could just figure out how to get wood from trees. It'd be a pretty easy weapon to maintain. And of course it's silent and everything else, so it makes crossbows good. Now it's out of ammo, so Gas can. I can use that to get that one car gassed up, even though it's still damaged to all hell. Nails. I need those for crossbow arrows. Ooh, that's cool. We'll go down there in a bit. I'm a little bit worried. A little bit worried about what might be down there. Empty can. Shotgun shells. Oh. Ah, attack a little bit faster, buddy. Sounds like there's stuff underground. Which I kind of expected. Okay, so is this really out of ammo? No, I'm not sure why it didn't reload for me earlier. This did not swing very quickly, so I'm not, not impressed with the sledgehammer. There is hardcore stuff underground, so... Could end up killing me to go down here, but... Oh, gosh, I fell. Is there anyone else in here? 
I did not do a good job of shooting there, but come on. Come on with the space issues. The berries. Eat the food. Eat the food. Oh, excuse me. Uh oh. There's that icon there that says I broke my bones. That's not good. Because I fell through that freaking hole. Hope I'm not uh, on a death timer right now. Bullets. I think I might need to use these. Oh yeah, I did it brought my health up, okay. I didn't fix my uh, broken leg issue. Okay, I just can't sprint, so that's not the worst. As long as there's no hidden death timer, I'm not too worried about it. Oh, it went away. Good. Okay, so there's food and stuff down here. A lot of sailor clothes here. Those are pants, and the other one was the top. I don't know if I like that better than whatever I'm. Whoops. <laughs> I don't know you can take your clothes off just by clicking on them. Eh. Not really a fan of either, really. I think there's a poncho in town, which would be a little bit cooler, but... Ideally, we would run with freaking... Uh, a toolbox I can take. Oh. Okay, use the ladder this time. So this seems like a decent, decently good place to like build a base if I wanted to. Ooh, a hidden, hidden bit of ammo. Cause there's all sorts of ammo and stuff here. And there's still food laying around. Can I use beds? Oh, it was my other use button, F. Yeah. Can't seem to. I have to be honest, this Uzi wasn't so great. There's no uh, semi-fire on it. It kind of shoots too much. It's kind of overkill. But... The machete is so much faster. Okay. I'm betting with this hand axe we can chop down trees. I should probably say I'm hoping. Oh, excuse me. Oh, an AK-47. Okay. What is that? Is that a rock? What is that? Yeah, it's just a rock. Okay. It's not a boulder. It's a rock. You have some skill points, I'm sure. Okay, sneaky beaky, less aggro and noise. Marksman, better accuracy and recoil. Endurance. Stronger mining and chopping. Increases crafting smarts. Oh, excuse me. Uh, survival.
Slower starvation, dehydration. Not too worried about that. Uh, sneaky beaky sounds like sounds like a good deal to me. I'm gonna take this AK-47. That's pretty cool. Give me wood. Piece of crap. I demand wood. <gasps> it gave me wood. Oh my god. It's insane. Never thought I would get wood. Okay, so. We got what we need. More or less. What does this outfield uses bonjour ammunition? Does the call uses savage ammunition? Well, interesting. Okay. I really need to find out how saving and exiting the game will treat my stuff. I'm going to kind of put myself in a place where I'm kind of away from the base, but close enough where I'll be able to see if zombies appear. So we'll quit here in this spot and come back next time and see if there's still zombies here. Till then, I hope you all enjoyed this video, and have a good day.